Hello, Seawolf here again on RPG A Day 2017, number 30. After this one, one more to go, although I might go back and do the ones I missed, just for fun. This one is, what RPG genre mashup would I like to see? I had to put a lot of thought into this because there is a ton of mashups out there. I love mashups. I love genre mashups. I love subject or title mashups. I did a Stargate Farscape mashup, a double GM at a convention, which was challenging. Uh, one group was Farscape, one group was Stargate, and they met in the middle. It was fun. I'm doing Titan's Grave now, which is sort of a genre mashup of fantasy and post-apocalyptic science fiction. Uh, I'm writing, in so many ways, a mashup of A Man in a High Castle meets The Expanse uh, in, in my version of Reichstar, Savage Reichstar. And I love, I've already mentioned through Octoon Cthulhu and all the other iterations of World War II meets Lovecraftian horror, I jump on that on any time. I've, I've run the World War I No Man's Land before, and that, that's a blast. It's long, but it's a blast. And I've mentioned Cthulhu meets Ka uh, Giant Robots, or Kaiju meets Giant Robots in, in, in Lo and Lovecraftian horror. Love those. What I think and what I'd love to see, and it's the only genre I can think of that I haven't seen, some have come close, and there may have been some obscure attempts at this that I didn't come across, but uh, Harry Turtledove does a series of World War II alternate history books, and it's basically alternate history meets alien invasion. And I'd love to see something based on that. And yeah, I fall back to World War II in any day, any time of the day. Um, it is one of my things. And I love anything sci-fi. So if we could get a, uh, a role-playing game based on something like that, that'd be awesome. And if not that, Civil War, Alien Invasion, Cowboys and Aliens. I know everybody has a um, overall groan based on that movie, but it had some cool concepts. You know, some of the old serials, uh, what was that called? Dark Empire or something like that, where the Cowboys and uh, a lost Atlantis type empire underground. I was fascinated by that show and it was, it was on PBS for a while. Oh, it was cheesy as crap. It, it was a cool concept. I think they tried to re resurrect that later in, a, in the 80s. But I'd love to see some kind of, you know, classic mashup of, 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 of historical, either you know, Western or Civil War, or World War II, or even World War One, and some kind of science fiction concept. Um, I've seen it with horror, with the weird war stuff, and it's that's not really my favorite genre mashup. I, I, I tried Deadlands, and you know, it just came down to blowing something up at the end every time, and, that, and that's that's my shortcoming, and not not the setting. It's just didn't match with what uh, I wanted to do. I think that's... The, I, I would love to, to run a campaign like that. Uh, alien... Uh, kind of an alien occupation story on Earth during an alternate history. Maybe at the peak of the Cold War or the 80s, V style. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, oh, oh. 
a retake on V, set in the 80s. Doesn't have to be lizards taking water and people for food. But something like that, oh, I gotta tell you, I'd be all over that too. That'd be so fun. So that's that's about it. Uh, I, <laughs> this one I, I like a lot is I love mashups. But I like I, I only like certain mashups. Obviously, with with Deadlands, it just wasn't working for me. I'll play a one shot. I'll do that all day. I couldn't do campaigns in that. I just I, it just didn't work with my game style. And other stuff. Uh, Deadlands Noir. I like that a lot. I like I like that kind of setting. I did Blood Blood Shadows, which is very similar. Um, horror meets noir. Uh, I love noir. But I don't like the stuff that doesn't make sense. You know, cartoons meets 80s, not, you know, 80s prime time, you know, something like that. Uh, that's just dumb. It's, it's cheesy. Uh, I don't like cheese. I, I like it to make sense. Until tomorrow, the very last day, and I won't be doing these until next year. I might try them again. We'll see. Seek the wolf in myself.